but we are uh, we're we're gonna go fly around in space, open world space sandbox. And I played Transcendence just a few days ago, and that one really focused on like the combat part of the game. This one really focuses on the sort of the sandbox of it. If you want to be a combat guy, you can do that. You want to be a trader, you can do that. You want to be a uh, like a mission runner or, or a, a, even like a taxi, you can do that as well. Uh, in this big big space, um, there you go big system that we can fly around in and just sort of live our life. We're just living the life of being a spaceman with our ship. And I think eventually we can have a fleet, but um, we start out with basically nothing and in debt and we will slowly work our way up. There's a lot of depth in this one. It's been around for a while, a while and on Steam for eight years now. And um, still regularly being developed, completely free over here on Steam. We're playing the high DPI version as well. So it is inspired by uh, Escape Velocity, if you're familiar with, with Escape Velocity, which uh, I've, I've talked about many times before here. Like that seems all right. All right. So we're going to go and start up a new game here. New pilots. Let's start a, uh, a new game here. So what's going on? Um, we are, again, this, this one really emphasizes like the sandbox. And so like we're going to the bank to go buy ourselves a ship. And what we do with that ship, that is sort of up to us. But my name is Wobo Starpath. And I'm going to get myself a, uh, a loan of 433,000 space bucks. I've got an interest, a daily interest of point, oh no, sorry, 40, 480,000 credits is my is what I'm borrowing. And I have an interest of 2,000 credits, 2,500 credits daily that I have to pay. So we start out heavily in debt and just trying to live the, the space life. Great game for the price of free, for sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Transcendence as well. All right, so we are now walking into the shipyard, walking to our, our, our new ship to see what we get. Let's go pick our ship out. We have two, three to choose from. We have a shuttle. The shuttle is is a, well, it's a shuttle. Um, there's a lot of numbers here. Basically, we're looking at how much how much weapon capacity, gun ports. This one has like free gun port on it. The speed. All we like care about is like cargo space. We got 20 tons of cargo space here, and we have one gun port on this thing. The star barge is the big the space truck. I'll get some music here in a minute. I thought I had music, but I'll get some. Um, and it. Um, where's my cargo on this one? I think it has 50. 50 tons of cargo space. So we can make some good money just like hauling things around. But it only, again, it has zero gun ports and and the one turret mount is um, not used. So this has no guns and just a big, it's just a big FedEx truck. Uh, and then we have the Sparrow, which is the interceptor. This one only has cargo space of 15 tons. We wouldn't make much money on this thing. It still has two bunks. So we could load some folks up here and haul them around. Uh, but we do have some gun ports. I think probably the better thing to do, though, for early on in this game is stick with the space truck, make some money, and then then buy a better ship. There's like 50 different ships in here or whatever. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, so the shuttle is, it's only a little bit less. The Sparrow's expensive. This one's a little bit less. I don't know really why you would choose this. Not designed to withstand combat of any sort, but they're fast and maneuverable. Get out of any any harm's way if attacked by a larger, slower ship. Typically unarmed and have enough space for one weapon, which is the origin of the popular phrase, as useless as a blaster cannon on a shuttlecraft. Oh yeah, that old saying. So, um, I guess you do get a gun port and not a turret port on this one. Yeah, we can take a shuttle, load up some some red shirts, haul them around. We get thirty. I'm I'm up for a shuttle. Shuttle's fine. I think last time I played, I think I played Star Bar Star Barge. So let's take a shuttle. Yeah, we're gonna buy this fella for three hundred thirty-eight thousand. My name of my shuttle? Well, we call it the Bob Ross, of course. All right, let's leave. I got one hundred forty-four, forty-two thousand space bucks. In my name now. With interpretation, you give your shipyard owner, the shipyard owner, my money and take my new ship for a test drive, piling it out of the shipyard onto a spare landing pad by the spaceport. You get out, you look over the ship a bit more closely, and I'm busy polishing out a few rust spots with the steel wool when an old man in a grease stained coveralls walks up. It's um, tutorial time. Let me play the. I thought this had music in it, but I guess not. Let me play the um, Stellaris soundtrack. 
because it's a good soundtrack and I think it's appropriate for what we're doing here. Um, this one. Something like that. How about that? Does that sound okay? Alright, so this guy has come up to me and he's like, Hey, uh, nothing like buying your first starship, he says. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, um, I can say, get out of here. I don't need a tutorial from you, but I'm, I'm still a little shocked over how much money I spend. Eager ends, I know the feeling. It's a crime how much interest the bank charges for first-timers. Yeah, it's gonna be a problem. Uh, you're a captain, I ask. Was, he says. Sold off my fleet a few days ago and I already miss it. But it was time, time for me to retire. His voice trails off, then his face lights up. Say, any chance you, uh, could hitch a ride with you? Maybe show you the ropes? Give you some pointers? I could pay you, of course. Uh, sure, where are you trying to get to? Well, he says I got a spot reserved in a retirement home, but I don't mind taking a roundabout way to get there. For starters, how about you give me a lift to New Greenland? Just one jump away from here, I can mark it on your map. Um, sounds good, how much are you gonna pay me? That's kind of a rude question, he says, but I'll pay you 10,000 credits. I guarantee that's more than any captain ever gets for carrying one passenger one day. Uh, thanks, buddy. Okay, my name, his name's James, my name's Wobo Starpath. Alright, uh, I, I help his luggage, I put him into his bunk. Before we take off, head over to the trading center and stock up on medical goods so we can sell those for a good profit. New Greenland, uh, at New Greenland. Make sure to visit the local outfitter. They don't sell much here compared to the big manufacturing worlds. Each world with an outfitter will at least carry a map with information of neighboring systems. Okay. So, um, every, um... Every system, basically, this is it. We're on the planet at the moment, and we're gonna go from planet to planet, landing on the planet, and um, selling or shooting or whatever we need to be doing. And each planet has different things. So we can go to like the um, the outfitter over here and buy some things. So we can buy all kinds of stuff to put into my ship. Um, make sure I got this. Make sure I, I do this right. So buy some outfits directly into your cargo hold instead of having them installed. Um, how about you need to switch out of installation mode um, into purchase to cargo mode? This can be achieved by control clicking on your ship to to de deselect it. Okay, purchase in cargo mode. Your ship information will be on the right hand side. Will be replaced by information on how much cargo space you currently have. Got it. Okay, so like if you want, so we can hold control click. So this is all my stuff I've got over here. I am just in the way of the leave button and my money. Uh, I got I got like five bunks, five free bunks here. Actually, six whenever James leaves. So maybe I should be just like hauling. I guess I'm going to be a taxi here. But every station we come in, we can buy a local map. And we will buy a local map. Um, and that will, you'll see what that'll do here in a second when we look at the map. Uh, and if we want new thrusters or whatever else, we can do all this stuff and throw it onto our, onto our ship. And um, we'll see what it does. So let's go look at, can I just look at the ship? Ah, oh, there we go. There's a map. Where are we? We are in Reticulous. Um, we're... Rotilicus, Rotilicus, and our job is, is to go to Arcturus. All these yellow pips here are different missions. There are missions available at these places. Uh, we're going to do the first mission right now. And we've got New Greenland over there. They're friendly. A big part of this is knowing what things you're going to buy and sell for here. So, like, we can see what prices are here and how much things sell for here. So, we can click on this one and see medical plus 94. So, as he was saying, we should buy some medical, sell it over there, make some money, you know? So we'll do that. Um, I want to go to the uh, trading. We're going to buy some medical. I'm going to buy all of it. So I got 20 for my cargo hold. And let's see what we can do. Shipyard, we can come and buy new stuff as we uh, as we get money. We can hire crew. Passengers as well. Uh, if we want to go do some missions, there's a job board over here. Like, say, deliver somebody over there or whatever. Anyone going to... Um, Arcturus. There's a rush delivery. We get more money for those. But it's a pretty, like, I haven't gotten into, like, the heavy fighting stuff. I've just kind of dabbled with, like, the, the early stuff. And it's a pretty, like, laid-back kind of thing. You know? Space trucking. That's really, that's that's what it is. It's very, there's a lot going on, though. It's pretty deep for what it, for that. Um, there's no, I was looking to see if there's anything going, going to Arcturus here, but there's not. So we're just going to take this guy over there. And deliver him to where he needs to go. Let's go to... He wants to go to the spaceport. Um, 
Oh, maybe not. Okay. Uh, are we good? I think we're good. Let's get out of here. We bought our stuff. Okay, so we're using the uh, the mouse, or sorry, the keyboard to fly around. J will jump me to my spot. I can L to land. M brings my, my map up. Um, and as I'm flying around here, you see things are just like, this is a very active place. Let me zoom out. Sometimes we'll get some systems that are a little more scary out in the outer places that are, you know, um, pirates and things. But anyway, we've we've already marked out our map. We're going there, so we're gonna hit J, which will jump us there. We're gonna do a do a little 360, you know, because you can't do a jump without spinning around in a circle. Okay, now we're looking for our system. There it is. We gotta turn this thing around. Slow it down. We don't have any like forward thrusters. So we're gonna come over here and ooh, slow down and land. Okay, as you land in New Greenland, James says, "Congrats on your first trip through hyperspace." I'm impressed you didn't throw up. Most folks do. First time? Including you, I ask? Yeah, then I spent half an hour in orbit cleaning my cabin while hoping the passengers wouldn't come out of their bunk room and see the mess. Not my proudest moment. Anyway, here's my 10,000 bucks. Yeah, uh, I've, I've seen a lot of folks that compare this, that compare this to Star Sector. And I think, yeah, um, it can be for sure. I think Star, Star Sector is a little more, um, I don't know, a little more, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, I don't want to say detailed, but the faction and the, um, like the f more fleet focused, I suppose. Star Sector will kill you. I mean, this one will too. Um, more like fleet focused, maybe? Fleet focused, and you go buy, you can, you can buy systems, you know, and I think it, that, that one's kind of leaning that way. This one is just, you're a guy out making a living in, uh, in, in space. Thanks, Burns. I see, I see you. Thanks, Burns. Sorry, I was, I, sorry, I missed. I sorry, I saw your joke, but I missed it. I'm sorry, Burns. Um, let's see. Well, uh, what do you say? Uh, spend a half an hour gives me ten thousand credits. Then he adds, if you're okay with giving me a, with you giving me a lift a while longer, sell off that cargo you brought with you and meet me in the spaceport. I'll see if I can rustle up any interesting work for you to do. Okay, so uh, here we are in New Greenland. Look at that. It looks like old Greenland. Um, peak of the turf wars here in. New Greenland, just like real life. We're gonna go do some trading and sell off this expensive medical, which is actually not real high, but it's it's decent. And we're gonna make 116, I think it's 116 per unit. So that's a lot. So we got 134, we're up to 148 now. So we're actually making a little bit of money. Um, I, uh, you can see there's a thing kind of scrolling back at the bottom. It's kind of, I wonder if, it's change, I wonder if I can change the UI. If I can bump it up a little bit. Uh, here's all my, my buttons, which I can change. Um, some factor, windowed mode. Um, I don't see like a size. Anyone see that? I want like a UI size. I don't see it. There's a main zoom factor. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. Look at that. Is that a little bit, a little bit better? Uh, factor of the gameplay when in flights. Also, be changed. With, okay, okay. Let's try that. Um, there we go. Uh, that's a little bit. That's probably okay. All right. So we sell that stuff off. Uh, if anything in here that is expensive, or if, let's look. At, let's look and see where we're going. Because if we're going anywhere else, we'll see where that where that guy wants me to do the job for. So we'll pop over here and see what he wants. Strong through the spaceport, walking briskly in order to keep warm and wondering if he might be worth investing in a good winter coat for visiting planets like this one. Eventually, you find James. His entire family, he has an entire family in tow, a young couple, an elderly woman, four children who range from age from three to four, three or four to twelve or thirteen. Captain Starpath, he says. Wonderful to see you again. I was just talking to this family. They've been having trouble finding a ship, single ship that can give them all passage. I told them your soulcraft has plenty of bunks. Uh, if the kids double up, they'll give you 40,000 credits to take them to New China. Just a few jumps away from Earth. Planet's well worth visiting in its own right. What do you say? I'm sure my shuttle wasn't designed to fit nine people, including myself, but if you're willing to squeeze in, welcome aboard. James helps the other older woman to up the steps into your ship while the younger family members carry the luggage. I have a, quite a full ship. So we're going to New China, which is... Uh, where is that? There, all the way up to the Mer to Merak. Make sure we'll grab us. We'll grab a map so we know how to get there. We don't know where that's at. Uh, if there's any jobs though that are going that way, then we will. We shall look. Um, I don't know that 
once I go through Mizar, then I'll know the prices, but because I'm not there, I don't know the prices. So, what we're going to do is stop at the trading. Not trading. The, uh, oh, this one doesn't have an outfitter, so I can't buy a map here. Well, there's a job, for, job board, though. So, if there's a job that's going to, like, Mizar. No, none of these, though. Um, let's just get out of here then. And we got my we got a map. I'm gonna go to Mizar first. And we'll buy a map from there. And we'll jump. Spin this thing around. Where's this planet at? Is there a planet here? Is that one? Maybe there's not a... Oh, actually, there's not a planet here to, to you. Okay, you know what? Maybe we go to here instead. Okay, let's jump. Does this, does this have one? I don't think there's any places to, like, land around here. Well, this isn't what I want. How am I supposed to get up there? Okay, well, let's go over here. Am I right? There's no planets in here? There's got to be something around here. Let's go look over this way. I only have so much fuel. I can only make so many jumps. I can only make two more jumps. Yeah, no roadhouses. <laughs> I can only have enough fuel for so many jumps, and, and I'm running a little low. Yeah, I think everyone's just sort of flying around here. What? Yeah, no inhabited planets detected. Alright. Well, we're gonna go there and hope there's something. Because if there's not, it's gonna be a real short. I guess we can go to Core Coralli. Just to make sure I don't run out of fuel. We'll stop by over there real quick. And maybe we'll pick something up real cheap. We'll refuel. We'll gas up while we're there also. Let's go right over here. Land there. Oh, I'm going too fast. I don't have an emergency fuel scoop. Every time you land, though, it gases up for... I don't know. If, I don't think it's free, but it gases up anyway. My money. Look how it's going down now. Uh, let's go to the uh, job board. Do we have anyone that wants to go to... Um, up that way? Caster. Big Sky. Let me go and stop in the Outfitter. And also install outfits directly on planet by storage, okay? I want to buy a map. A thousand bucks. Okay. Now, does that give me anything? There we go. Now we know how to get there. Okay. And we know Algorel over there. Which we can sell stuff there. We can sell stuff in Fecta. So, if, like, food is very expensive in Fecta. How is it here? Is food cheap here? It is real cheap. Yeah, look, let's load up. Okay, my tiny cargo hold. We'll take some food over there. And if there's any jobs going that way... Nothing now. No. Okay. Uh, let's get out of here. Let's go to Fecta. Jump. Can I recharge at a sun? Is this true? Spin this thing around. Is it the planet? Yeah, there it is. Oh, there's some shooting going on. I better land. I'm I'm too scared of that stuff. Okay, New Sahara we're at right now. We're going to sell this food off. Make a lot of money. Hey? Eh? I wouldn't even think this is how much money I actually just made. Where's that at? Um, what do we got trade-wise, um, here? I suppose we'll look at the thing in a second. Anyone going to Merak? Corporate espionage. Oh, I'm excited about that. I don't think so, because it'd be yellow, right? Yellow are the, are the missions. So, yeah, nothing there. Um. I think, whoops. I think 
think I'm good. And then we'll go see just if there's anything here. Like, we actually don't know what's in Merak. So we can't sell things there. But we could pick up, like, plastics on the way back. But no, we'll just go here. I don't know. Well, hang on. Anything low? Plastic is low. So we could, like, buy it and maybe make some money. And if we don't, we'll sell it somewhere else. Industrial is low for 603. We would make a lot of money on that one, I think. Let's do it. I'm willing to gamble. Okay, going to Marak. Jumping out of here before things start to shoot at us. I can shoot by hitting uh, tab. Over here. Um, oh, if I had a gun. I don't have a gun. If I had a gun, I could do some shooting. Okay, here's New China. Go stop off over here. Okay, if, along the journey, you learn that the family are tr you are transporting are named the Hendersons. They're moving their new, to New China most because they hope the urban setting will be better for the kids than New Greenland, where there were hardly any children at all, and their village had only a few thousand people in it. The grandmother, Olivia, has also been chattering nonstop about how she excited she is about... Uh, about being on a world where she can actually go sunbathing. I've gotten too much too old for snow snowshoeing, she says. I say goodbye to him. They gave me 40,000 credits. I'm already on my way towards paying down my mortgage. As James leaves the ship, he says again, if you're okay with giving more uh, missions, meet me in the spaceport, he says. Okay. Um, interest was very low here. I would lose money, so mistake. Mistake. What's he got? Uh, don't take you long to find James in the, in the spaceport. He's already got a small group of people. With a middle age. He's got more people? Who is this guy? Uh, a month takes some tourists to Earth. Sure, sure. Great, he says. This is Chuck and Sarah and their son, Carl. I was helping carry the luggage onto your ship. As you begin walking back slightly ahead of them, what James whispers to you, tourists are always a good way to make money. They're on vacation, so they don't mind paying a bit extra. But no point in your cargo space going to waste, so take a look at that job board and see if there are any delivery missions we can run at the same time. Want to be a little safer? We should we come across any pirates? Sell off any guns you might have. It might seem counterintuitive, but being unarmed makes you less of a target to pirates. Okay, okay. I would love to have done job. Board. Maybe there's a job board of people we can do. We're going to Seoul over here. So uh, we've got a mission to go into Vega. I'm not sure why it doesn't say Vega, but there we go. So we got two passengers to Vega for twelve hundred bucks. I got. I think I have room for them. How, many, how much cargo space do I have? Uh, how do I know? I got those people though, right? So I got more than... I have less than that free. Maybe that family only takes up one space. Oh, let me buy a map. Yeah, it does kind of sound like some bad advice, doesn't it? If you see some pirates, make sure you don't, don't carry any guns on you. Like, what are they pirates for then? <clears throat> there we go. So yeah, we can get we can get to Seoul a little bit easier. And there's nothing. There's no missions going that way. There's one going to Vega to carry a couple people there for twelve hundred bucks, twelve thousand bucks. Um, we can pick them up. What's the, what's the harm in having them with us? They're only one jump from Seoul. Takes two bunks. Yeah, sure. I mean, that might be around for a little longer, but I'm sure it'll be fine. They'll love it. Okay. Um, let's go. We're good, right? Um, I'm not sure what crew does for me. Every year, extra crew for your flagship increases your odds of capturing ships. Once you capture a ship, you need crew members to serve it. Oh, okay. Interesting, interesting. Okay. So, to Seoul. Let's go see Earth. This is exciting. Uh, we don't need to go to Geyser. Yeah. Hey, look. It's Earth, and Mars, and Luna. Make your final landing and descent to the surface of Earth. Chuck and Sarah stare at the window in a rapt, in rapt attention, pointing at landmarks on the planet's surface. 
James joins him by telling you all about some of the history of the cities you're flying over. Carl, meanwhile, has spent the entire journey playing a handheld video game. Oh, kids these days. It only glances out the window when the ship shakes from turbulence. As they all grab their luggage and step off your ship to explore humanity's homeworld, he's still immersed into the game. Collect payments. James pulls the parents aside and says, watch out for pickpockets, okay? Take it from an experienced captain. You don't want to be out after dark here. Play it safe and have a good time. After they leave, James shakes his head ruefully. It'll probably be a decade before that kid's old enough to realize what he's missing out on. Waste of money doing a trip like this with a teenage boy. They should have gone to Skymoot, seen the dragons instead. I'm sure that would interest him a lot more. Skymoot? I want to go there. He picks up his luggage and adds, same deal as before. If you want to keep traveling together, meet me in the spaceport. Hey, Blue Zest! A Zesty Ray, this is the starship Panda Surprise requesting fuel. No fuel here, get out of here. Hey, Blue Zest has a gun. Ooh, Slipstream. I don't recognize that name. I, I, I don't recognize that. I'm going to have to see what that one is. All right, well, anyway, anyway, welcome to the stream. Uh, we are at Earth. Look, we're here. We're at Earth. There's pickpockets around. And um, it's a new one. I will definitely have to check it out. And we've just delivered some passengers here to Earth. And uh, we're trying to make some money. We can make a little bit of money by selling this industrial off. We can buy some cheap med, med supplies, though, and go sell them. Let's do that. We'll sell these things off. Let me check the uh, the job board before I go do anything else. Let's see where it wants to go. Oh, you know what? Actually, I should do. I'm going to Vega anyway. So um, we're going to go make some money in Vega. By the way, new folks, we are space trucking today. At the moment, we're space trucking to, at the moment. We'll, we'll do some space shooting before long, but right now we're space trucking. Transport farmers to Mars. 5,000 bucks to go across the street? Yeah, I'm not going to say no to that. Okay. Spaceport on Earth is so big and crowded that it takes a long time to find James. Sheer number of people here is almost overwhelming. Homeless men wrapped in old army blankets beg for, beg for money from well-dressed businessmen. Uh, I find James. Get me busy all streamed. It's worth a look. Open alpha ends the 15th. Oh, okay. It's like F FTL multiplayer. Oh, fancy. Fancy. I haven't, yeah, I haven't seen Slipstream. A Twitch streamer game. Interesting. Yeah, this is this is the, um, this is the Stellaris music. No in-game music here. If there is, I don't know. Uh, maybe I have it off, but <laughs> I didn't look. When you find James, he's standing in by a window, looking out the city, watching the starships taking off and landing in a continuous stream. This is it, he says, where our race began. Okay, he's, yeah. Uh, taking a one last glance out the window, he says, Anyway, we're near my destination. You want to take me on one last trip? I need to get to Hestia in the Talita system. I'll pay quite well to take me there. Yeah. Once again, you walk back to your ship with James. Once you get there, he's stowing his luggage. You pull up the information. Why do you keep taking your luggage off the ship for? It's one of the paradise worlds. Terraformed to have a perfect climate. Okay. So James is going to Hestia. What, what system was it in? should say in it's in Vega no not on it there he is in Toledo so we're gonna go up, up there so we'll get a map we'll go to Vega and drop them off and then we'll head up to Toledo if there's any other missions though that are going that direction that Valhalla one or the Vale one is kind of close I think well it's like a couple jumps looks like we'll just go to Val or we'll go to Vega sell some stuff make some money that sounds like a plan uh, while I'm here, shows where systems with spaceports are, as well as other plethora of other things. Okay. Uh, I don't know what about prices. I do know prices in, in Vega. Okay, so here I can pick up some... Did I buy some things already? Uh, I can buy industrial here and sell it down there. Industrial or equipment will go well. I'll buy, industrial is the best, so I'll just buy some industrial. And we'll go sell it down there, because we're going there anyway, because we're going to drop these, these people off. We gotta try, we'll take some people over to Mars. Right, which is right here. Too fast. There we go. Okay, wish them luck. 5,000 credits. Uh, if, um... I'm going to drink at one of the spaceport bars. A somewhat scruffy-looking man in dark cloak pushes aside and offers 50,000 credits for discreet, no-questions-asked passage to New Austria. 
in the Mincat system. Close by. Quick and lucrative job. Sounds illegal. Need to avoid getting scanned or landing on planets with high security. Um, I mean, I'm... I just got my ship. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just like, you know... I, I, I'm, I assume this guy is an upstanding citizen and just... You know, maybe he's famous. Maybe he's famous. He doesn't want any, any um, you know, people looking at him. Is it in Mencat? Is that where we're going? We're going to Mencat? But then I can't go to... I gotta go... I gotta, like, speed through Vegas. So I'll drop these people off in a minute. So we're gonna go to... Actually, Mencat is an even better place to sell this industrial as well. So we're gonna make some money. Big money. Okay. Mencat. Mencant. It is. All right, that's the mission. In the Minkin system, New Austria. 50,000 credits. That's a lot of money. That'll pay off Jabba for sure. Okay. Let's do a map. Uh, oh, there's no map here? Oh, because I'm on Mars. Okay, well, we're not going to go stop back at, at Earth because we're going to get scanned. I don't want to get scanned. People will, like, yell at me and stuff. And... <sighs> this guy's real famous, so I don't want him. People are trying, attempting to scan me, but I got out of there quick enough. <laughs> okay. We made it. Where's this station at? Over there? Okay, let's get over there. Get over there before they, um, they scan me. Land. Aha! Big money! Passenger has spoken hardly a word during the entire trip. As you land, he hand you a payment of 50,000 credits. Disappears into a crowd. I should tell those other people that are in my ship. Say, hey. Do you know that was someone famous? Here we are in New Austria. Um, I'm going to sell and make a lot of money. Look at that. I got 222 grand now. I'm so rich. I'm rich in dad jokes as well. So, um, I use, um... I had this girlfriend a long time ago, and um, she was like a, a bit of a fashionista, if that's the word you want to use. Um, I had to, had to break up with her. She was just too close-minded. <sighs> mm, look at those luxury goods for low. Speaking of luxury goods, no, not good. Ah, we can buy some clothing here and sell it in Vega. Excellent. Excellent. That was a segue. Anybody want to go to Vega? No. Somebody does want to go to the moon. 17 tons of frozen fish, but I I'm full. I can't I can't carry 17 tons of stuff. I got I'm 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 full. Anybody want to go? No. Just that, there's just, just a, um, 16,000, it's only 7,000, okay. I ain't delivering fish. I'm better than that. I, 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 I carry, um, famous people around. Uh, let's get out of here. Okay, I'm taking my clothes back to, we're gonna go to the Vega, and then we'll go to the moon. Or, no, we're gonna go Vega and sell this clothes. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I do like that it, that it, 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 it like... Let you know if you're making money or not. And it's not like, uh, I'm not having to, like, pay, take notes. So we'll make, we'll just do the, uh, we'll do the, um, space truck and life here for a little bit. I did not mean to do, what I just, where am I going? Don't go up. where am I going? Oh, don't go, I didn't, did I hit J? Whoops. Actually, we can make more money if we sell stuff here, but too late now. Don't hit J when you're supposed to be hitting L. J jumps. L lands. Yeah, they do change. Well, yeah, by the time we get that, they can change. That's for sure. And I don't think he mentioned it here. Maybe he'll say it somewhere else once we get him delivered to it where he wants to go. Um, that you can like you can make a good living like you can find like like this clothing route we can do clothing route back and forth but if you do too much the prices will start to stabilize and i think it like attracts pirates or something if you do the same job over and over again all right so we're in silver a lush tropical world but it's mostly desert now and it's hot in the daylight which means people want to buy clothes i guess so we're going to sell that clothes for big money 
Um, and we're gonna take a look and see what else anyone wants out there. We're going, um, well, we know where we're going. We're going all the way up here to, to Toledo. So if there's any systems that, anybody that wants to, oh, hey. Luxury goods, make 174 bucks. 193 on the food. Let's stop in Denebola, drop off some food, and then head back up there. It says it's high here, but it's even higher there. All right. Anything in the spaceport? I'm gonna drink at one of the bars, a somewhat scruffy looking man. Again? Really? Rotilicus system. Yeah, I mean, it worked before. I'll do it again. Where's that at? Rotilicus. Down there? Right. There's a job in Minkit. What is that one? I'm not sure which one of these is Minkit. Can I click on it and see it? Yeah. A passenger. Yeah. Uh, because I got this other guy, I'm going to get scanned if I do that, so I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go straight there. We'll get this guy delivered in a minute. He's he's fine. Let's get out of here. Uh, yeah, I'm, dr <laughs> I'm drinking in all the shady bars. That's where you make the good money. Shady bars. Okay, we gotta get here before we're getting scanned. How many wayfarers does it take to change the light bulb? Zero. We didn't use such told technology there. Good, good jokes. Land already. There we go. Okay, fifty thousand. Uh, I'm not allowed to lose a lot of money there. I'm not doing that. Anybody want to go way north? No, we can go by Altair. What's this one? 20,000 for people going there? I'll do that. I'm going to go that way anyway. So, yeah, we'll go there. Sure. Okay. Outfitter. I'm going to buy a space map. Oh, I guess I already have that space map. I could probably get looking at some new things. My, I still have 300,000... I'm um, 300 bucks, thousand bucks in debt, which I need to sell off. But I can get some new things for my ship and make my ship a lot cooler. Or I can even buy a new ship, which um, I can go to the shipyard and pick up something cooler. Well, same thing as what I've got now, but I can eventually find something cool and get a real ship. So we're going to Porama. Let's jump. Drop off these, the good people to Porama. We'll stop in a bar while we're there, I guess. We got enough for one more jump. There be shooting going on. Oh! Easy there, easy there, easy there! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, 20 grand for that delivery. Uh, typically when we're in like the, the core worlds here, we should be mostly safe. It's when we go out in the, the fringe space, we're gonna start getting shot at a lot more. Um, uh, if there's a job going up this way, there's one going to, there's three going to Pollux. 6,000, what's the other ones? Two passengers there for 21. 12 tons of honey. For 30,000? Do I do it by the December 28th? So we got a, a while, I'm not, actually, I don't know how fast things are going by there. Um, I think we do it. Rush delivery to Thrall. There's rush one going to Earth, too. 18,000. I'm going there. I'm going to do it. I'm doing it. I don't know how to get there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's good money. 20,000 credits to get there with the two factory workers. It's possible we could get there. I'm going to do it, because I think we can go to Regulus and then make our way over there. I don't know if it's that big a deal, actually, though. Maybe we'll find something better up there in Toledo. Ah, I'll do it. Okay, so we want to go to Regulus. There might even be a system, in, uh, a space in Regulus. We'll just pick up a map here if we can. Um, I'm writing a new song called Babies and Napalm. Nobody seems to like it. What do you think? <laughs> okay. Uh, there's no, there's nothing here to to buy, so uh, I think I pay back some of my thing. Yeah, so there's my payment. 
I'll pay a bit. So I want to pay off a hundred thousand. Okay. I'm at 361 principal. I even have a, even have a credit score. A crazy game. I don't know that there's a system of Planet in Regulus. Part of the Republic, but I don't know if it actually has a system. I think I need to go to Marak and pick up and pick up a. Um... What do I have my cargo hold? Where am I, where am I gonna sell that at? I have a bunch of junk in my cargo hold I'm supposed to sell. Yeah, there. I was, I was going to sell it somewhere else, but I'll sell it here. Now I... You know what? Well, now I can do the honey job. Honey job's gone. Oh, man. I missed the honey job. All right. Well, we're going to go to Merak. Is that how you say it? We can drop off some luxury goods while we're there. We're going to go there anyway. Drop off some luxury goods. Just make a little cash. Hoping I'll get shot at. Back to New China. We've been here before. Okay, so we will drop off the luxury goods. And I need to buy a map. Do I have this map already? I think I guess I do. I can buy a laser rifle as a step up from sidearms that crew members typically carry for defense against pirates. I feel like I need a laser rifle. I'm not entirely sure why I need one, but I feel like I need one. One of those installed. Um, now, these are power. Look at all the stuff they've got here. Ooh, they got torpedoes. I've got space for a gun port, which is going to be these guys. We so got guns and turrets. Um, the beam laser. Eight outfit space. What am I saying? Out outfit space for you. I got plenty. Weapon capacity, plenty. I have eight space free, ten capacity free, so I could hold this one. I could hold this one also. This one does more damage. One boss is not, not enough to do appreciable damage, but anything larger than a fighter, a ship to cover with, equipped with several of them, becomes a force to be reckoned with. I mean, this would be nice, and it would give us the outfits. We can fit it. I'm gonna, I'll, give me one of those. There we go. So now we got a gun. I got a gun and a gun. Okay. Now let's say I want to hire a crewman. What if we hire do I have an empty bunk? Oh, I just did it that way. Um. Okay, so we got one guy there. We got one guy. There you go, buddy. I got a gun for you. Okay. Okay, and then we want to go to Toledo, but we can't. I guess maybe we need to go that way. I can't buy a map. I could go to Denebula and hopefully, hopefully find a map. That's a garbage payment. We need to get up there. This guy's going to be pretty grumpy if we don't go up there. Um, I forget... Remind me what it said before. Does that mean that there is nothing in this system? Is this one I went before that had nothing in it? And I got lost? And I was surprised there was nothing in it? Or was that, was that further down here? That was right here. So I know there's things there. I don't know what's there, though. I think there's nothing there. I don't, the only, all I have is this guy, right?
They don't care when they get there. They don't have they don't have a date of when they want to be there. Um, I could go that way. I was just kind of hoping regulars would be would be the way to go, but I can go up there. I won't hurt anything. No, I didn't get the honey because I went back to it, but it was it was the mission was gone. There's a rush delivery to Earth. Um, oh, the shipyards and what everyone holds. Look at that. This is five million credits for this thing. I won't get one of those anytime soon. I can get some drones. I get a freighter there. There's a oh, I can get a heavy shuttle. That's the next upgrade. A wasp a berserker. Cool. Million credits. Oh, that's so expensive. There's the outfitters. There's ports. Yeah. Okay. Well, in Marak. We can make a heavy, hefty profit on medical in Tania Australis, and that'll get us up that way. So let's go buy some med, meds. Wrong one. Pick up some meds there, and head out that way. Anything at the spaceport? Walk through the spaceport. You see someone ahead making obvious disruptions in the flow of the crowd. They're going up various people and talking to them, usually very briefly, before moving on to someone else. Before you know it, someone else is you. Uh, you're a captain. Will you give me a ride? I need to uh, get back to Tinker in the Difda system. Pack up my things and travel to Lycan in the Atria system. The Harris looked back to match their sharp suit. Um, I need to get to the Tinker, get to the Difda system, and then get to the Lycan system. How How much? I stopped in surprise. The nod refill. I'll be at your ship within an hour. An hour later, you see them approach Bob Ross carrying a small suitcase. They've exchanged their formal appearance for a button-down shirt and skirt with their hair loose. Walk right up to you and stick out their hand. Chris Brecht. I'll shake their hand. Robo Starpath. That's all you got with you? Chris nods. All the rest of their stuff is on Tinker. I'm just here for a meeting with some others who feel like I do about the establishment. Oh, I just let it pass. I don't support government or any of its tools, and I've heard that the South is more open to this kind of philosophy and lifestyle. Before you say more, they walk past you onto the Bob Ross. Wish did you see my was my birth again? All right. All right. This guy's gonna be talking to me the whole time. Why? Did he carry junk onto my ship? How do I sell it back? Where's he want to go? Oh, he wants to go way down there. That's a long way to go. He's gonna be he's gonna be here for a while. And he's taking up five of my cargo space. Can I kick him out the airlock? I'm gonna board it. He's gonna be 38,000 38, credits to take him down there. He's taking five tons of personal space. I wonder if I should just kick him out. Yeah, get out. I'm gonna go back and pick up more more um, stuff, more medical supplies because there's gonna be a, there was gonna be a lot of money out of that. Okay. Okay. No, no more no more strays. Thanks, Abby's. Shoot going on over there. I'll stay away from. Am I? Is this my system? Oh, I thought it was more jump. Over here to ingot. Okay, um, we'll make a, some make a lot of money on that one. Uh, industrial is very low. I'm gonna buy it. I'm sure that's gonna be the best, no matter where I'm going. I'm going here. We don't know the prices over here. We know that here, I don't know the prices are anywhere else, but I know it's gonna be a good deal because that's very low. I know that's cheap from what I've seen before. 
I will make sure there's nothing on the job board. Yeah, I'm using the mouse wheel to zoom in and out. Let's see what's in at the spaceport real quick. Man pulls me aside and asks if I would help him transport nine tons of recreational pharmaceuticals to Calda for 86,000 credits. Sounds illegal. I wish I knew where Calda was. Why can't you tell me where Calda is? Like, is it close? Is it far? I'm going to decline that. If I click on it again, does it come back? No. I feel like I need to... Maybe I can hit M and it'll keep me there. I don't even know where Calda is. Yeah, I think it's unlikely that I would find my way. <laughs> I don't know where that is. And sometimes it tells it says Calda, but it's not the Calda system. It's a Calda planet in whatever else system. So, yeah, who knows where that is? So, um, I'll, I'll try hitting I'll try hitting M next time I'm in there. Okay, bye, industrial, and deep art. We're going over here. We'll stop off in. No, we'll go there. That's where that guy's going. The get the um, the colonists. I'll take them over there. Yeah, I was just talking about how I didn't have to go and memorize these things. Paid a hundred credits to crew salaries. Maybe I shouldn't keep that guy around. Hundred bucks a day to sit in his bunk and hold a rifle. Okay, but I just made 20,000, so it's okay. Um, what do you got in the shipyard? Anything cool? Oh, you do. You have the flyver. Okay. Cargo space? I haven't shot my gun yet. I should shoot it. There's that heavy shuttle on my, my, my next step. Look at that. Ooh, look at that guy. How much is that? 5.6 million. There's a light freighter with a cargo space of 130 tons. 2.8 million. They got a mule here. And the mule, that's a um, EVE Online ship name too. Look at this guy. This headhunter has 50, car 50 tons of cargo space. It's also 2.6 million. It's all so expansive. I'm going to have to like, I'm going to have to make some real money. None of this, like, baby money that I'm making. Yeah, I'm gonna make some real money. Uh, was there a spaceport, anything? Among the bustle, uh, hustle and bustle, figure catches my attention. A woman stands alone on the side of one of the passageways with a bubble of space around her. Uh, she seems to be saying anything, at least. Um, not saying anything. When I get closer, you notice a large package at her feet. Something about you catches her attention. She looks at you with an eye and beckons. Now, what do you want? Make your way through the crowd edge of the bubble. As soon as you do, she extends her hand. I'm Tori, Tori DuPont. I'm Wobo Starpath. I tell you, you're an independent captain. I would like to hire you to transport a package. She indicates a box beside her with a nudge of a toe. Um, wouldn't it be easier and cheaper to use FedEx, SpaceX, Space, UPS? She gives a sardonic smile. The thing is, I'm sending it to a friend who's an NCO in the militia for the Southern Mutual Defense Pact. Normally it'd be fine, but there, then there's who I am. She reaches into her pocket and pulls out a piece of paper. Uh, protest block access to council chamber for fourth straight day. Underneath that picture is a picture of Tory. So you see, I'm already being watched by the Republic government, but with all the rumors lately, I don't really want to do anything that would throw any suspicion on to Irene, but... She glances at the box. She's barely been missing some of the stuff from home. I don't want to make her life less pleasant. Um... Planet Express, there you go, there you go. Uh, oh, where's it going? So it's going to, it doesn't say. It doesn't say where it's going. How am I supposed to know where it's going? Is it that, is that it? That's it. Okay. Yeah, um, that's a long way down there. How much money are you going to give me for this? It doesn't even say how much money. Uh, if you're being watched, I don't want to get in trouble. She grimaces and nods. Understandable, she says. Okay. Um. Okay. 
Let's go to Talita. We're going to finish our tutorial mission. The Congo is scanning me. How about you stop that with your fancy orange ship? So I think there is like a big story here where like we're gonna have like different factions in space that are gonna be fighting and stuff. And I think we can like join in, we can like we can join with one of the factions and partake. Pilot of the US ship down to the to Hestia James disappears into his bunk room. After the ship was landed, he comes out. It's no longer in the grease stained coveralls he's been wearing up until now, but in a suit. He's wearing a fancy suit. How do I look? He says. Uh you look great. Let's hope the locals think so. Um this planet is one of the most exclusive retirement communities in the galaxy. Plenty of locals are probably worth more than a billion credits, but they're mostly financial or business types. Old money. I'm rich enough to be here, but I hope they're willing to socialize with someone who made his fortune flying a ship. Anything else you'd like to know, he says. Um, have you ever met any aliens? I've spoken with the Quarg a few times, but what captain hasn't? You'll find them down in the south by Terrazid. I've met any other aliens. He pauses for a moment. As far as I'm aware, that is. I'm sure they're out there. If you go looking hard enough, explore all over public space in many years, but there are far more systems out there that we don't even know how to reach. Um, where do you find the good money? Getting good jobs is about having a, the space to accept the good jobs, and then finding them. More than that, then finding them. Um, you want to watch out for the uh, watch out around the holidays. There's always a big celebration on Earth every April 22nd, Earth Day. Pay attention to the job board and the months leading up to that. People down the rim have some month-long celebration every August. You should look out for it, too. Okay. 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 Hand you a credit chip worth 30,000 credits and says, Best of luck to you. Look me up if you're ever in the area. And remember to check the spaceports wherever you land. You don't know who you'll find walking around there. You know, I've noticed that. Okay, let's sell some money. Uh, it's not a big money. Is there a bigger money? Industrial money? Now, let me pick up a map. You got a map here? You get a map. What's a paralyze? Um I wonder why I I would need to buy one of those. Can I lose my license? Maybe if I get maybe if all the if I'm walking around with like illegal stuff, I lose my license. I have to go buy another one. It'd be nice to have a, a missile. Or a ship that wouldn't just blow up immediately. Uh what a uh, what about what about now? Do we know anything over here? Yeah, so we got Caster over here. We know prices now, also. We'll sell the industrial real quick. Pick up some electronics while we're here. Unless it's a job being well. Here we go. Twenty-one tons of diesel fuel going there. I can't haul that because I don't have enough money. Right? I don't have enough space. Two passengers. 49 tons of stuff. Hmm. Two farmers for 17,000. What's the other one over here? Twenty-six thousand credits to go all. That's a long way down there. Pace gold. I think I make more money just by just by doing a, a trip real quick. <laughs> hey, Sunbow, thanks for the sub. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna buy what was that that was selling real well? Or selling decently. I go metal there. Let's go let's go drop some metal off in Pollux. Anything in spaceports? Excuse me, Captain. Turn around and see a woman flying a flag, trying to flag you down. I heard he was tall and somewhat confusing. Well, like a sort of captain I can trust, he says. My darling Pookie has been visiting her aunt in, on Shroud. Time for her to come home, but she's not used to space travel and it scares her. Much better if you could go pick her up and bring her back here. Can you do that for me? Can't help notice the jewelry she's wearing probably costs as much as a small fighter craft. Mm. Where? You want me to go out there and get her? Yeah, you know what? Sure. Be glad to assist. No harm will come to Pookie. Gives you the information in the Alhika system. All right. Yeah. She has a ton. She has a ton 
of cargo space. She has a ton of luggage, I guess. Yeah, there might be dragons out there. I'm looking forward to it. Martini is the name of the place. Dump that metal off. We're going uh, way up here. I'm going to take some prices. We can do four jumps before we have to stop and pick up some more gas. So we could go up there and sell. Not really anything selling real well here. That might be this is not a good system for, for buying and selling. We can drop some equipment back off over there. Or is there maybe a mission? Maybe there's a mission. What's this one? Motherboards. Four passengers for 24,000. Two wealthy tourists want to see... Um, Pearl in the Furad system for 30,000. Two people for 30,000. Or four for... I can't carry all of them, can I? Let me try it. It takes three bunks, yeah. And these guys take three bunks also. I think. Oh, I have three available. I'll take I'll do that one. That one's that one's more money. No, I can't do that one. Okay, well. We're going to this system. Let's pick up some equipment. Drop it off while we're there. Really? Alright. Hopefully it'll still be there. I'm making a ton of money on these on these uh, things, but they're like they're paying my my interest basically. I need to get I need to get some more money to pay off the ship, get that loan paid down. Just so I can go in debt even more. Look out for marauders when you're traveling far to the north. Mm, that's exciting. Um, yeah, sometimes you just want a good old sandwich. So we're going to Alhika. Let me see if I can pick up... Oh, no maps here? That's not going to help me any. This is an unexplored system. Oh, do you have any maps? Uh, I need outfitters. Why does it say there's outfitters here when there's actually not? Right? Am I with that wrong? Local map. Oh, there are no maps here. I can go to unexplored space, but that sounds scary. Um, I guess we can go to Wazen and see what's going on over there. Oh, it has no outfitter. Ah! Thank you, Tarok. Sells this outfit. Okay, okay. We don't know what's there, right? Because that's unexplored. Wasn't, but we know something there because there's a mission going there. Three passengers over there. We're going there anyway. We'll take them. We don't know any prices here. But if we can find something like real cheap. We'll take some cheap clothing over there. No, we won't. Sell this equipment off. Take some equipment, some of that over there. Okay. Is there aliens up in the north? I hope so. Okay, ten thousand bucks. I will sell off. I'll make a little bit of money on the clothing. Sounds good to me. I got some real cheap metal around here. I would like an unexplored system. I gotta get up there. There ain't no maps around here. We can go to Alhina and buy a map. Maybe that'll give us something. 
we'll do that. And we'll see. We can pick up if there's any, like, deals in Alhina. Make some heavy metal over there. Rock on. I'll go there. I'll buy a map from there. And hopefully that'll give us some more stuff. People are trying to scan me. Um, okay. We'll dump these off. And we'll pick up a map. Buy that. How are we looking now? There we go. Okay. Excellent. No outfitters out there, which I guess is okay. We do have a mission up there. It's that same system we're going to. What is it? What is it? Transport mill workers. 17,000 to go up there. Yeah, I'm going there anyway. Why do they want me to go that way? I want to go through fact. Yeah, I'm going to take that one. And then we're going to go through fact because it sounds exciting. And nothing here is real cheap. There's a little bit of metals a little bit cheap. I guess we could stock up on it. What's at the spaceport? Elderly man and woman sitting at a bench talking about something that seems to be causing them an amount of stress. Hey, what, what's wrong? Old timer? A woman begins telling you her life story. We're yard workers on here on Mainsail for nearly 50 years, but we started to get old, for, too old for our jobs. We made a hard decision to retire. Chosen location best for us we could afford. It happened to be Earth. So Charles and I are looking for someone to transport us. Um, Charles begins to frown. I suppose you could put it like that. Um, uh, the old man is mad. Of course it's wrong. We spent our whole lives working for these spoiled brats. What do we get in return? We get dumped on Earth like dead weight. So he's all grump grumpy about this. Uh, they'll do it for 11000 Uh I'm not going that way. Sorry. You're going to have to be angry a little, a little longer. I, I'm going to go stop by the bank and pay off a little bit more of this. Let's pay off like 75000 Work this way, this thing down as much as I can. It'd be nice if I could get it to zero. I can qualify for a new loan of up to 54,000 credits. Well, that's awfully nice. Uh, <laughs> don't want to go through that because I can't handle the truth. <laughs> Uh, let's pick up... I'll, I'll just pick up some uh, metal, because it's cheap here. Maybe we'll maybe we'll find somewhere that wants it. Okay, we're going to Fact. Oh, we know the price is in Fact. That's not a good deal for metal. Well, we can sell it, sell it in Canopus. I guess I should have looked at that, shouldn't I? I didn't realize I knew the prices of Fact because of the maps. Um... I can sell equipment and cannabis for a lot of money. Sounds like my stream's just starting. Turn that thing back around. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to buy this stuff. I'm buying some equipment. Right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good money. I'm going to go there. Yeah. So the relative to... The, yeah. That's what exactly what it is. Relative to the price that I... What it is right now in this system. It's going to change because a couple days are going to go by before I get there. Oh, there's shooting going on. Ouch. Missiles. Ooh. Ouch. Oh. Uh. It's going to be... Uh, excuse me, sir. Can you please not shoot me so much? I'm disabled. Uh, what are you doing? Are you boarding me? Your Bob Ross has been plundered. Mission failed. Pookie. Oh, no! Oh. <laughs> what, what happens now? Whose idea was it to come to this system? What do I do now? <laughs> um... What's the, um, there's a hail button. Talk. T. Uh, hey, you. Can I talk to you? 
think I'm, think I'm just dead. Thanks for helping me out. Can I load this one before I die? Which one was this? Um, is this right now, you think? Spaceport, okay. Oh, this one. Okay. All right. Where am I at? You know what? Uh, maybe, maybe we don't... What was that? That wasn't in Wazen. That was in fact. Maybe we go this way. Uh, what, what do I have? Do I have my stuff? I got my equipment. Yeah. Um. Let's not go through. Man. Game over, man. That's rough. I didn't expect it to get blown up. I thought they would just sort of like leave me disabled and so I could talk to somebody. All right, let's make some money. Make a little bit of cash. And anything else worth um, worth buying over here? There's a, a mission, A. Eh? Nine tons of olives over there. This is where Pookie's over here. Deliver nine tons of olives. Rush, rush delivery of olives. It's very important. We got a blinky one over there. Okay. Let's get. I got a little bit of extra space. I don't know how much prices are over here. So I'm just going to pick up cheap medical. Just stock up the rest. And let's get over there. And let's not die this time. Okay. I'm scared of ships now. You stay away from me. Don't look at me. Don't scan me. Okay. All of them have been dropped off. Workers have dropped off. Pookie! You called ahead while your ship was landing and agreed to meet Pookie's aunt at the spaceport. She told you to meet me outside the shop with the ridiculous sheepskin coats. The shop's not hard to find. Mannequins in the window look like feral sheep over on wool and bad need of grooming. The only person standing outside the shop is a tall woman in a suit who's busy making furious marks on some sort of document with a red pen. She's a small poodle on a leash. Been busy nipping at the heels of everyone who walks by. Uh, I'll, I'll interrupt her. Excuse me, you say? It looks like he was withering glare. I'm looking for someone named Pookie. Thanks heavens, she says. She's all yours. She hands you the leash and a large bag that appears to be full of chew toys. Here's her toys, her food, her outfits, which she hates. Feed her twice a day or she'll go berserk. Don't feed her more than twice a day or she'll throw up. <laughs> when she continues rattling off instructions, you wait. Pookie's the dog? Short for Pocahontas, she explains. Good luck. I hope my sister pays you well. She walks away. Nothing it can do but bring Pookie back to your ship. She immediately lifts her leg against the landing strut. All right. All right. Um, and she's got to go back. Back. Where? All the way down there. I got a couple missions here. Can't do that one. I can do three passengers there. And some okay, so I'll do the two tons of porcelain. I'll do it. I may drop some some stuff off here. I'll do three passengers, and I'll have eighteen tons in a minute because I'm gonna sell this stuff that I've got right now for not much money. But um, oh, I'm gonna be short one. I need eighteen. I miss. I can't count. I can't count. 18 tons. Not 19. Not 17. Well, I guess it's okay. Oh, yeah, my crewman. He's using a... He's using one, isn't he? Oh, uh, yeah. You're fired. Oh, I thought he was using one. I thought he was using one. Okay. Must have been the other guy who was using one. That's fine. That's fine. So we'll take we'll take those two over there. Uh, we may actually know prices over there. 
We do. So we can drop off some electronics over there while we're heading that way. Okay, let's get out of here. Porcelain unloaded. 6,000 bucks. There's a job going to here. There's something on the Pollux. Four tourists for 34,000. Just about three petty criminals to Martini in the Pollux system where they'll serve as sentences as domestic servants for twenty for 30,000. I need more space. Why can't I do this one? I don't know. Uh, I might do that one just for the 34,000. These rush delivery ones are probably pretty good. Let me check the... Before I do anything else, let me check the spaceport. No. Okay. Uh, well, I'm going to sell these electronics off. And how much money am I making from that? Where's my Where's my list of... I guess how much I'm actually making from that. Is, like, is it better to do that or do these, these proper jobs that are going around? I don't know. Um, I got 270. I've, I'm gonna sell, I'll do the 58. We're just gonna keep myself at 100,000. We'll get this thing paid off real soon. So we're heading down here to Toledo. We know any prices. Ah, oh, food. We're gonna sell some food to Toledo. If only I had a ship that could carry a lot of stuff. See, who's using the ones, who's using the one ton? Is it one of, is it my mission? Oh, cause Pookie. Pookie using it. Yeah, yeah, as the tutorial popped up, except a K and an M as a thing. Mining. I forgot that was a thing we could do. Past few days, Pookie has barked incessantly and thrown up several times despite being fed perfectly on schedule. The room you've been keeping her in will likely smell like dog urine for months. You're too happy to return her to the owner who pays 80,000 credits. Nice. Okay. Uh, I'll go to. I'll, do, I'll drop the stuff off to sell. And then we're going to go to the spaceport. Uh, we've got a family wearing floral shirts pull along their luggage with a man of the family flaunting a souvenir from faraway planets. To your right, a cleaner whistles a tuneless song. A man in a prim suit approaches you. Good day, Captain. Would you mind if I spoke to you for a moment? Sure. Uh, you see one of our clients recently passed away, and in his will, he divided his property between each of his relatives. The problem is that one of the family members, his, one of the family members, his niece, lives all the way down in the rim. Deliver her portion of the inheritance, weighing five tons, to her residence in Skymoot. Skymoot? That, that sounds... Is that dragons? That's where dragons are, right? In the Hadar system. For 100,000 credits. Yeah, I'll do it. I don't care what she's getting. I'll do it. So I was glad to hear that. We all have the cargo loaded onto your ship by sundown. Can I go look at it now? Where's this at? Where am I going? Oh, Hadar over there. Okay, we gotta find my way there. So we'll stop in Cor Coralie, which is still a lot of jumps. One, two, three, four. Can I go to Atania? Two cat, two passengers there. Let's just take those guys. And we'll, that's, that'll be our next stop, Tanya, and then we'll head down here to Cor Coralie. Dragons. I hope it's dragons. We're gonna go make some money on... Ooh, nothing expensive. Everything's expensive over there. I guess we'll do some clothing. Oh, metal. We'll do some metal. I wish there were different colors. Stand out a little better. Okay. Um. Anything else I need to do? Oh, I'll do my bank thing. Okay. 
Okay, my payment's on only 700 bucks now. <laughs> yeah. There's no, no pirates down there. If there's dragons, though, I hope to see that. Am I here? I need, like, a like a little ding or something to say I've, I've arrived. How do I add that into my autopilot? Okay, 14 grand. Touchdown and ingot surface up out in the open air. The landing docks are emptier than usual, with only a handful of people walking around. Suddenly you feel the wind knocked out of you as you collide with another person and fall on the pavement with a thud. Whoa, 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 I, you better apologize. Open your mouth and lift yourself up, only to find the other person is already gone. You look around, you spot a piece of paper with writing lying on the ground beside you. You pick it up and note the, read, note the note and read it. Robo Starpath, you're currently carrying five tons of cargo to Skymoot. The cargo has been described as an inheritance, and you've been promised 100,000 credits as payment for a job. Under no circumstances should you allow the cargo to reach its destination. Instead, bring it to Green Rock in the Shaula system. You'll get paid 300,000 credits if you do so. Back of the note has a code you can use to gain clearance to land without the usual toll. Put the paper over and see a string of letters and numbers. The note has no signature, nor anything else to identify the person who wrote it. Well, I'll keep that note. But I wanted to see the dragons. Where does he want me to go? Show something? Oh, down there. Hadar's over that way. It's way down there. 300,000! Well, can I just look? I want to see what's in there. Look look in the cargo hold. Oh, yeah, there's no way of doing that. Hmm. I don't know. I got some farmers want to go to Cor Coral. I'm going to drop them off real quick. I could go to Skymoot, yeah, and then just see what's going on, I suppose. I can still go to Skymoot. So I get to choose. I get to choose my, um, my, my place. Which one do I do? So we're going to go to Cor Coralai and drop off some plastic or metal, uh, medical, medical. Why is there, um, things going off? Now I have to imagine dragons. Ah! <laughs> um, I've been trying to get a hold of you. Wait. Everyone was talking about this slick new trend. We're about to go go orbital. You should sign up while you can. Someone's talking to me. I was uh, busy looking at reading the message, and I flew past my my spot. Okay, 20 grand there, and whatever else that's going to make us. The big question, what do we do? I'll let you decide, chat. I will responsibly pay off some of my, some of my debt. Man, the thing would be certainly paid off, though, if I got that 300,000. It'd also be paid off with 100,000. But with the 300,000, it would really be paid off. I'm here for a... Ooh, there's a... What's that one? I'm here for a map. Don't really forget that. Eight tons of mercury going down there. We can stop off. I saw my name listed. It is system radio chatter, but I saw my name listed. Han. I've been getting... I've been getting scam messages in system chatter. Look for Skymoot. I wish I could look and see what it is. This guy seems pretty sketchy. And I'm okay with sketchy. Hey, Uncle. How's it going? Do I already, do I already have this, this local map? Oh, uh, so I don't want to be here anyway. 
Well, we go to Mulafane. No, we can't. We can go to here and buy a map. So I guess we'll go. We'll go there. See what that gives us. Um, any missions going over here? No. Well, we can see what they want. Over here in Vin. They want nothing really. It's a little bit of clothing. I, oh, 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 oh. Why am I going there? Yeah, I saw it. We're going to the Saren system. I saw it. New Kansas. Hey, 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 hey. People are shooting at me. Land quickly. Oh, no. Oh, everyone's shooting at me. Where's the police? Land already. Whew. New Argentina is dangerous. Man. All right, I'll uh, I'll sell this stuff off. Um, I'm here to pick up a map. And I got a gun. I probably should use it. How about a sh I have a shield generator? Can I make it better? Make better thrusters. A heavy rocket sounds pretty cool. Um. All right, so... Oh, there is a mission going to Hadar. Yeah, there's that one. And then there's... A tourist wants to see Skymoot for 18,000. All right, I'll do it. I'm not happy about it, but I'll do it. Assuming I can find my way there. This didn't give me a map. Am I supposed to... Did I buy the map? I did. How do I get there? Hmm. I can go to... I think if I go to Saren, it, it will show me some things. So we'll go to Saren. There's a station there. I think... Yeah. So we can see what's going on over there. I'll go ahead and take the Hadar mission. So the tourist wants to go there. I'll take him. And we'll go there. We can go to Wyvern... Wyvern Station. Yeah. We'll go to... Well, we went, we went through Mulafane already, didn't we? And we didn't see anything. So I won't do that one just yet. I'll stop off over here in Saren. I'll take some food over to Saren. Okay, let's take the spaceport. Stout man wearing a fine wool coat approaches you. Captain, you help me out with a delivery? Um, where are you going? Stored on New Kansas, you have to go there first to pick up 15 tons of wool garments. Then take it to Blood Sea. Go there, and then Blood Sea? What the heck is that? Could you tell me where that is? The Lawless World. Home to countless bloodthirsty pirates. How much? 90,000 credits. No, that's not enough for me. I don't want to die. I think so. I think I get fixed. Yeah, when I when I dock, I get repaired. So I'm not worried about that. Um, I'm worried about the pirates outside though. Okay, so we're gonna go to Saren, drop off this clothes, maybe die. I haven't showed you any shoot. I haven't even tried my gun yet. See, I got a gun. I should use it. Not be all scared. These guys warm and fertile. Okay, so we'll drop these guys off, which is not much of a bargain, but it's something. And I don't know. Do I have to go from down here? You think it's it is an arm? I think you're, I think I think you're right. Way to go by by way. Problem is, I don't know what's in way. 
I'm gonna be scared about way. It's gonna be bad news. Which way does it go? No, this is, I'm playing Stolar's music. Do we go, you think we go down here, or do we go up here and around? And it looks like it goes down here. Like there and then around. Yeah, we're gonna have to go down the way. Let's see what mission this is going to Aliath. Two prisoners over there for 12,000 credits. Some heavy metals. Don't, don't attack me. Don't don't do do it. Red blips all over. Yeah, there's there's no music in the background, so I, I figured Stellaris was appropriate. You just want me to help shoot? I'll help shoot. Let me at him. <laughs> I got him. Oh, yeah. Can I go rob him? Ooh, what's that? How do I pick that up? Hang on. Where's my buttons? Select. So, next hostile ship is R. Board ship B. Scan ship S. How do I collect that, that thing? Oh. Auto steer. Gather around me. G. That's a, that's a fleet commands. I'll try R and see what that does. Lucifer the portly. I'm getting kind of scared. There's a lot of things there. Please land. I'm just getting scared. Okay. New Tibet. Um, don't think less of me. It's very scary out there. I don't want to die. I already died once. That was real scary. Two passengers want to go deep. Okay, we're going to Cornhole. Okay, and what is what are they like down there? We don't know. Unknown government. That's exciting. We've got food that's very low. So we'll take some food down there with us. If there's a, maybe there's a job. Oh, we got the job already. Maybe there is a spaceport job. Let's go there. Yeah, I saw that. I gotta figure out how to like fly things. Wait, where am I going? No, don't. No, 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 no. I'm that way. Okay, the way, and then corny. I'm getting shot at. Ouch, ouch, ouch. And I fired my gun, but I shot it at the police, so I should be careful. I remember to hit tab and hit my gun. Uh, which one do I want to go to? I'm going to go to deep. Okay. A little bit of money. Okay, so we got to go... I'm going to guess this way. Makes sense. Uh, no outfitter here. I'll pick up some low. Well, there's a passenger who wants to go to Zug. This way. I'm going that way. Let's do it. I might as well take some money over there while I'm going to go make some money. And do I have money? To, oh, I, I could pay off. Some of my, my I'm not gonna pay all. I don't want. I don't want to go below, hundred thousand. Uh, I will pick up like luxury goods are cheap. That's below a, a thousand is cheap for luxury goods, so I'll pick up those. What if I just go like here? To to not that one. To to clink. How do I select clink? Yeah. I still make money in Clink? Sure. I'll buy them from here. Is there a job for here to go anywhere? No. Okay, 
Now we can go this way. I hope there's no space monsters out there. Yep, ended up in the clink. You're in Savic. I don't know how many Star Trek or whatever references we're going to get here. Long Jump is the most industrial world with lower and normal gravity. It makes it relatively easy to operate. Or maybe these are real system names and they're just taken from other places. Uh, hey, there's an outfitter. Ooh, excellent. I saw those missiles. Those are nice looking. Give me some of that. And then let's, le let's see space. Ooh, there we go. And there's a mission over here too. What's the mission? Bring uh, a passenger there for 5,000 credits to, to Zub. And we're going by Zub anyway. We're going to take it. And then what does Zub, what does Zub like to eat? They like to eat equipment. So let's buy some equipment. Spaceport? No. I'll sell these because they're not going to make any money on these, but I'll make a lot of money on that equipment. So we'll sell these for a little bit of cash. Buy all those. I'm not making, making much money at all with these. Like that, 15, that wasn't really anything, but I made 75 bucks there. But I'm making, you know, a few thousand with each one of these. If I had gotten that ship that had the, uh, the big one, the big drive. Did I pick that one? Whoops. Isn't this where I want to be? I don't see a... Isn't this where I want to be, Zub? Oh, this Zub. Okay. Yeah, paid for my parking. We're still in Republic space. Okay, there's a bit of cash. And there's an outfitter here too, so I'll go ahead and pick up another... Ooh, there's a lot of good stuff here too. So I have... That's what I've got. There's a modified one. Has a better range. It does about the same damage. That might be actually better to have. But I'm gonna wait until we get something better. I wonder if I can support one of these. I guess not since it's not highlighted. This is 15 mass and this is 22. So I have to take out my gun to put a shield on. Cooling, I don't have cooling problems. Energy prob uh, things. Look at all this stuff. Um, one of the things I can get that might be useful is... Is it this guy? This guy, I think. No. A fuel cell? So I have that fuel cell. What's the one I need to get me to give me more jumps? There's an afterburner, which we can get eventually as well. Accidentally shoot friendlies? I don't think that would ever happen. Now just sacrifice some cargo space in order to make room for more outfits. Huh. We can get a brig. We can get an extra... Oh, so we can take off some of our cargo space and make bunk space. There's a cargo expansion. It's five mass and 20 outfit space, but I don't have room for that. But we could just turn, we could strip this thing down and make a big old hauler out of it. The shield though, so this one is, now I guess we could probably do it slightly more powerful than the shield generator, which I have baby shields. Come out last long enough, the recharge rate is enough to give you an edge, but recharge your shields completely will still take a long time. Probably would be a good idea to go something like that. So this one gives me... I don't see what the, what the charge is. But the energy is 19 versus the 12. Probably would be a good idea. Um... But I'm going to keep my gun. I want to shoot things. And as soon as this guy's paid off... 
there's a freighter. How much is that? These are all like millions. Million. This one's 1 1.2 million. The little clipper here. 70 tons of cargo space. Four gun ports. And then we can blast some folks. That might be the way to, the way to go. Work up on that guy. Um, I bought that job to Hadar. 12 tons of welding torches over there for 13,000. I don't know what I'm what I'm paying here, but I will do it. I'm going to drop the other stuff off. Yeah. Okay. We're good. We got three jumps going to Hadar. Let's get there. There's a freighter park next to the Bob Ross in very bad shape. It holds pockmarked, pockmarked with blaster scars. Large dents. Busy welding a new hole plate on there. What happened? What well, we were a conversation to figure out what the freighter was attacked by pri pi uh, pirates. Most is helping to get in the way, uh, get in the working condition. A little spit shine, it'll look as good as new, officer says, but the captain of the ship doesn't look convinced and walks up to the ship and work on it alongside the crew. The officer glances over his shoulder and having spotted you listening in, waves you over. No need to be shy, he says. I'm guessing you're not from around here. How can you tell? Captains from around here don't rubberneck at everyday occurrence. After seeing your first dozen or so damaged ships, you eventually get used to seeing them and just move on. Pirates rough around these parts? Rougher than you're probably used to if you're further up from further up north. Navy doesn't patrol these parts, not unless there's some high-profile warlord on their radar. Because of that, pirates have more free reign to terrorize us down here. Pause for a moment, we'll turn it back to the freighter, and the pirate fleets keep getting stronger every year. What can I do to help? Um, have you heard of the Southern Mutual Defense Pact? No. Collection of worlds that have decided that since the Navy doesn't patrol this part of the galaxy anymore, it's up to us to keep the pirates in check. The idea is if the pirates ever try something big like capturing an entire planet, that planet will call on, uh, on the entire pact to assist them. And as you can see, we do our fair share of helping the local merchants as we can. Sounds like a good idea. It's launching a new initiative led by myself, she says. We're calling it A Thousand Eyes, asking merchant ship captains to let us access their scanner logs, basically using merchants as a surveillance network. You don't have to fight the pirates. Just let us know if you see them. Yeah, that sounds exciting. Great, she says. Right now, we need more eyes and a few systems in the southern edge of, uh, edge of southern space. Space south. Fly through those systems, then report to our base on Glaze in the al system. I'll mark the target systems on your map. And uh, her name's Freya. Okay. Where's my money? How much money are you going to give me for this? Money? Money, money? Fly through there, there, all around this way. Okay. I'll get there eventually. I'm not in, in any hurry for that. But I'll get there eventually. Did I buy a map? Yes. the old spin. Oh, capturing... Yeah, I didn't think about that. Capturing disabled pirate ships. So when they get shot down, I can go board them. I can hire somebody to be on my ship and then go board them. Uh, yeah. Stop off your ship in the old, um, and order the spaceport crew to unload your cargo. As you do, a large, fat-lipped woman walks up to you and says in the most exaggerated manner possible, Thank you so much, Captain. You must have gone through so much trouble to help little old me, she gasps. Silly old me, I forgot to tell you who I am. I'm the recipient of an inheritance from Hestia. Of course, you have truly made a great contribution to the galaxy, she chuckles. What was it? Before you get a single word out, the woman exclaims, I'll be sure to inform your employers of the wonderful work you've done. Ta-ta. She begins to swagger towards the cream-colored car as her inheritance is loaded into a truck. Return to your ship's cockpit, you find 100,000 credits been depos deposited in my account. Oh, I could have made a lot of money. Today, throughout human space, is Remembrance Day. Anniversary of the beginning of the Alpha Wars more than five centuries ago. The Alphas were pro genetically engineered soldiers. Con! Complete lack of compassion and empathy. At the height of the war, dozens of planets have been enslaved by the Alphas. Remembrance Day commemorates the war. Since the Alpha War, genetic sequencing technology has been very tightly controlled. Look, dragons. The dragons of Skymoot are an immensely popular tourist attraction. Tourist attraction. Unlike their mythical namesakes, only in their lack of ability to breathe fire, 
The presence of such efficient apex predator has spurred the evolution of a stunning variety of defense me mechanisms in its prey as well. Whether in the air, on the plains, or deep in the forest, Skymoot is a dangerous place to visit. Scientific consensus is that the dragons are clever animals, but not sentient. Those who insist on trying to find ways of communicate with them is almost invariably end up getting eaten. Dragons. I'm hiring a crew member. I'm going to give him a gun and point him in the right direction. I would like to uh, make some money. I'm paying off my debt. Pay it all off. Uh, all of it. 94, 234. Woo, no money. All right. And I get a loan for 600,000 now because I'm paying my debts back. Hey, do you got any cool ships here I can buy? Any jobs I can do? There's a job to Zeta. I guess so I got to go fly down there, I suppose. This is a rush delivery of 13,000. 5,000 over there. 14,000. I mean, I would jump over there. 13,000 for jumping to Dune? That sounds a little, a little more scary. Okay, Dune it is. Um, I will sell my this stuff. We're going to go to Dune and bring them some plastic. Pirate coming in. I should I should try to shoot. Hooray! Debt free and welcome to Arrakis. Oh, look, it is a desert planet. Mostly desert world. Uninhabited until recently when geologists discovered the bedrock under the desert is home to many rare mineral deposits and gemstones and worms. Give me a map. And there's not a star port here. But I will sell this stuff off. Two passengers want to go there. One there. Any good... Oh, there's an Earth Day celebration. Bring 27 tons of trail mix to Earth for 64000 Man, if only I had a bigger ship. Um, shipyard. Is there one nearby? There's one in Zub down there we can go stop at and just see what they've got. Let's go to Zub. What do you want me to do? Bring a passenger to Zub? Sure. Zug. Zug in the Zub system. Let's go there. And I want to see what they are buying in Zub. They're buying pretty much nothing. Some heavy metals. Okay. If I see that pirate in that last system, I'm going to shoot him. My last girlfriend wouldn't stop ranting about how she thinks members of the parliament love black shiny cubes. All right. There's a pirate. I'm going to see if... I don't like this, but I'm going to try... Oh, he's bigger than I am. Oh, he's a lot bigger than I am. Help me out. <laughs> ouch, ouch, ouch. Where's my friends at? There we go. Why is he coming after me? Okay, okay. This is a place for me. I'll just hang out here with the dragons. I'm gonna lose money here. Uh, is this not where I want to be? I'm, oh, I'm in Hadar. I gotta go one more, one more jump. Okay. I'll be fine. Okay. Any, any like debris? There's one going in there. I'm out of here. Man, space is active, and look at all these like asteroids flying around. Space is crazy. Okay. Land here on Zug. Farewell, passenger. It's cheap prices here. Anybody at the spaceport? Walking through the spaceport, a man approaches you and says, Captain, I need a rush delivery of 19 tons of, of fiber to... Wait. 19 tons of high tensile fibers to bounty. 
All right. My ship needs repairs, and there's no way I can make it there before the 18th of March. Can you make this for me for 61,000? I will do so. Yes. Where's Bounty? Way up there. Okay. Delta Valorum. All right. Well, we're going to go to Sabic first. We'll take some passengers to Sabic. We'll make our way back up there and make some money. Okay. Anything good in Sabic? Heavy metals. I can only buy a couple, though. I don't have any space. I got one space free. Uh, what do you got in the shipyard? Okay, so I, I can I can get a loan for six thousand. So this this is worth two hundred eighty seven. I could buy so much money. I don't have no money for that. I gotta get a bigger loan. I can get a star bar. That's like a like beginner ship. Oh man, I like that. I have that. But five point seven million for that. What will the bank give me? Yeah, six hundred thousand. It's all a loan's gonna give me. So I gotta make some money. That means next time somebody says, Will you do this thing that is probably illegal for three hundred thousand, I'm gonna do it. I could do one, but what what's the big deal? You know, who cares? I'm basically just gonna go straight there. If there's any, like, wrecks laying around, though, then I... I'll make some money. I'll go loot them. We're just going to come in here. We're going to take a, a stop real quick. For that. And then if there's another... Let's please work. Um, I represent a recently deceased client here on Long Jump whose legal papers need to be delivered on his next, next, to his next of kin on Ada in the Aldebaran system. 100,000 credits! Uh, where's that at? Oh, that's a long way. I got a lot of flying to do. Okay. I accept this challenge. <laughs> okay. Um. How am I going to get there? Oh, Debra. Wow, that's way over there. Which one's first? So, Bounty needs to be done by the 18th of March. This one's the 25th of March. It's already the 1st of March. So we're going to go to Delta Valorum and then run over to there to Ada. I can do it. I can do it. Three, one, two, three, four. I can't quite make... I guess 8,000. I don't care about that one. I'm going to go... I'm going to see if I can run to... Was Vindy the, like, the bad one? Two, three, four. I'm going to try to go to Vindy. Maybe I'll safely make it to Vindy. Oops. Jump. So I need to have like I need to like it's like two million for a good ship. I'll get these these jobs done. These are both worth quite a bit. I'm gonna get blasted. Oh, this guy's giant! Giant! Oh, is this my my? Oh, I got I got taken out. No! Help me out! Help me, please! Please! Okay, I'm back! I'm back! Oh, wow, 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 wow! Man, this is a bad system. <laughs> What's going on here? New Tibet! Nasty. Okay, thanks, Storm Lady. Um, I wasn't doing anything. I'm just just gassing up. One, two, th three, four. I guess we'll go to Tereus. Let's see if we can get there in Tereus. I'm gonna hire a couple crew because I want just in case somebody decides to like, um, you know, board my ship. I can shoot them. I'll try that. Uh, I, I might I might pick up another gun. While I'm home. No, it's upgradable. Yeah, it's it's upgradable. It's just my ship is is pretty basic, and I don't have a lot of upgrading I can do. I'm waiting to see if there's any sort of like derelicts around here, but I don't have any space anyway, so I guess I shouldn't worry about it.
So I, I, I can upgrade my ship, but not much, basically what I'm trying to say. Somebody's shooting. Okay. Um, there's a mission there, but I don't have space for it, so. One more jump and we'll be there. What day is it? It's the 10th of March. We gotta get there by the 18th. I think we're gonna make it. It's a day per jump, I think. shooting going on. Okay, 60,000 there. If there's a job going, like, anywhere near, so one, two, how am I going to get there? Probably, yeah, I got to go up this way. Can maybe get through Seoul. Not really worth it. One, two, three, four. So we can go to Alf Alford, which does have a, a station. A day per jump plus a day if I stop. Okay. I'll make it... Yeah, I'll make it plenty of time. Plus, uh, I have space now, right? Yeah, I got lots of space now. What does Alfred want? Oh, wow. I can make a lot of money. As long as I don't get blown up. Ah, thank you, asteroid. <laughs> Just saved my life. <laughs> no, this is Stellaris music. Is there a map I need to get here? I'll go ahead and pick that one up. Uh, I'm going to get an extra laser rifle. I assume two of them are going to be a good deal. I don't know how that works, really. Um, I would like... Oh, look, there's a ram scoop. Okay. Yeah. So the thing is, we've only got so much space on this ship. We've only got so much outfit space. And... I could rearrange some things, but there's the fuel pod. That's what I was thinking about before. Fuel pod. Cost, it takes eight space to be able to get one more jump, which maybe is probably good for this kind of ship, but I spent I spent uh, some of my money on, on this. And what do you have here? Oh, a scout. That's that's doable. 55 tons. Got a lot of fuel capacity. Bunks, 12 that's cool. What am I going to buy that? Is a scout worth it? Or maybe it's just I go to... I can, I can afford the heavy shuttle. 40 tons of space. 10 crew. This guy's got any guns? He's got two gun ports and a turret mount. If I get a... I can get a loan so I can get... Sell mine for... I basically have... I got 500,000 in my pocket. So what, 1.1? 1. 1. So I'm a little bit short on buying this scout. Okay. And that might be what I get, though. Some money. Okay, and now we're on our way. One, two... One, two, three, four. Can't quite make it in one jump. But I can go to Capella. Sell some industry.
Jafar Kree. Okay, Capella system. Where's the planet? Am I in trouble? Where's this? Where's the system at? There it is. I didn't see it on my map. Refuse to let me. Why? Refuse? Why you refuse? Why is it why they refuse to let me land? But I can't get here. Oh, how do I how do I um Can I talk to someone and ask for help? Hermes is a military base. Is he gas gonna gas me up? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, buddy. How much did I pay for that? Okay, Ada. We made it. Hundred grand. Okay. Um, what kind of ship do you have? Heavy shuttle. You don't have the cool one that I was looking for. What's the bounder? Scout ship and courier and designed not for battle, but for carrying passengers and small amounts of cargo. Yeah, it's only got two turret mounts. I want something with some guns. I want to shoot some stuff. These are all too much. I can almost afford the Quicksilver. You know, a Navy license to to have these. Now, it's let's say I wanted to do something like that. How do we go about like signing up? My map. My map. No jobs around here. Um, I can try going back up north again because there was some exciting things up there. Farmers want to go there for thirty thousand. One, two, three. I can do there. One, one jump can be there. The Earth Day celebration was only nineteen thousand. Eh. Maybe some money as well. But that's thirty-two to go up to Canopus. We're gonna be from fact. That's a bad place. It's way over there. We did have the one, the pirate reconnaissance. We could go do. We could. That's way down there, though. We can do some scouting. Over that way. I feel like I need a better ship before I do that, before I can do that. Let's take these guys over there. Oh, no, I don't have people. I don't have a space now. Never mind. I need three bunks for that. Uh, I, I will. I'll I'll do it. I'll fire our crew, and we'll do it. <clears throat> so, did you know that the uh, kind of odd, but the guy that uh, invented the Ferris wheel. And the inventor of the merry-go-round never met. I guess they traveled in different circles. Ah, no money to be made here. No money to be made in that joke either. Different circles. It'll take all night, but I'll get I will get a new ship, and I won't have this dang shuttle anymore. I kind of wish I'd bought the I don't know I did a, I've done a lot of uh, passenger hauling. Ooh, ooh. Shooting, shooting. I'm joining in. I'm joining in. Let me at him with my shuttle. <laughs> Who's the bad guy? That guy over there? Oh, he got away. Oh man, but I 
was so excited to shoot him. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Chaos. <laughs> Scan my ship. <clears throat> Alright, splash down. Um, what do you got here? I'll sell that for no money. I think I'm gonna try to make my way up to like we got a we got a mission there at Beetlejuice. What is it? Oh. Two thousand bucks. Not a lot of money. Probably make more money by going to here and making just selling metal over there. I wonder if you have a good idea for me just to go bounce bounce back and forth a whole bunch. If it, maybe that'll give me something. Is my thing going? Is my bank loan amount going up? Yeah, I'm at seven oh seven, so it's slow, very slowly going up. Big ships, big ships. We don't want this. Maybe I should have stayed around there. I'll shoot each other. I asked for my I asked my dad for a dad joke once. He told me to look in the mirror. <laughs> oh, Triton Station. Restricted. I want to go look at it. That's so. That's a military spot. I want to go see it. Wish I could get something from there. What do you got here? There's the fliver, fliver. It's tiny. Blackbird. I want something with some guns. These aren't gonna. I, well, actually, that's not terrible. Oh, it's expensive. Star Queen. I just can't afford this stuff. Well, um, what's up here in safe? Six tons of inverters. I'm kind of curious what's up. Let's let's just go kind of explore one jump away. We'll see what's over there. Maybe we'll be uh, we'll make it make it big. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That you blasted me immediately. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I stepped out. I got blasted. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, let's let's load that one. Okay. Well, so when we step out this time, we're gonna be real careful. Real careful. I'm gonna hire my crewman back. Everything's fine now. I need a better ship. There's Beetlejuice. Okay, there's 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 red things. Beetlejuice is way over here. Way over here. Oh, look, there it is. Big. Yeah, it's giant. There's a red giant. There's shooting going around. I, I want I went in on it. Let me in on it. I don't want to like shoot anything, but I'm gonna go board somebody and take their stuff. Lugger. I got him. I got him. Go board that ship. Ship is disabled and needs your help. Patch them up. Pressing B will fly you to their ship and get them up and running again. What's the... How do I scoop this stuff up? How do I get it? I don't know how to get that. How do I loot? Do I need a... Maybe I need a scooper? Hmm. I don't know the button for it. But maybe I need the scoop. Board selected chip. No. 
Let's try V for the nearest asteroid. S scans. I don't think it's possible to get it. Is that what a, I, th I thought it, a scoop was going to be for stars? That's what it made it sound like. Yeah, that's just basic stuff. Hey, Lawler. There's all kinds of shooting going on over here. Mighty strong words from the pirates down there in chat. There he goes. Hey, hey, you know. Take that. Take that. Bad guy blowing up? Yeah, I want to board him. I shouldn't board him while he's blowing up. Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> Look at my ship. It's off this. It's got two little pips of health left. Hey. Can I can I have get some help? It's scary out here. Thanks, buddy. Well, I wish I could like Wish I knew what I was doing with <laughs> scanning things. Well, let's go to Beetlejuice. I don't see any derelicts just like floating around. Um, here on Prime, we can buy same things as before. I can get that heavy shuttle. That might be the next the next upgrade, I suppose, because that'll give me. It's only 40 tons. It's not that much of an upgrade. My ship is about the size of a missile fire from another ship, yeah. I'm going to keep looking at these. One of these days I'll be able to buy one. Uh, let's go to the spaceport. Anything here? Why well, is no one at the spaceports? One passenger for 5,000 bucks? I don't know about that. Fact is a scary place. What if I thousand go over to market? But I don't know how to get there. We might, might have to go down over here to Epsilon, all the way over that way. I don't know how to get there. We could take a look over here and see, but then the, then the mission will be gone. Over here at Far Point, um, I'll deliver a, a passenger up there, and then we'll see what's over there. Maybe by Bandy. Oh, look at... Th no, no, different one. Okay. What do they want over here? They want a lot of medical. They want even more electronics. <clears throat> I know, yeah. Electronics. By all that... Man, wouldn't it be nice if I had a ship that could hold a lot more than what I hold now? That one holds 20... Or 4... Uh, it's 40... I'll hold 20. I want that one I saw before. I took all the jobs for the same destination that I, that I could do. Yeah. I didn't have the cargo space for the other one. Thousand. We'll sell these for two hundred bucks a piece. Seven eighteen. Like, let's say we just go. That's a lot of money. Why don't we just do this back and forth? Here to here to Beetlejuice. Is that where I went? We go to Beetlejuice. We drop off luxury goods. We go back there. We sell the electronics. Maybe we just make some money that way. There's two missions going on over this way. It's safe though. It's not worth anything. So, let's try... Let's do this. 
I'm gonna go back and forth, just back and forth, back and forth, to make some money. And they want, what was it, luxury goods? Luxury goods and electronics. Not a lot of money, because I don't have much of a ship. Let's make some cash. I got a few more, like, um, passenger pods, but they don't pay very much. No problem with Beetlejuice is it's way over here. What was E? Pro pilot? It doesn't seem to do anything. Enlist in the Navy. Yeah, you know what? I'd be okay with that. And we buy some electronics, right? That was the one. Back over there. Actually, medical is better. What do we get? Oh, we only got 3,000 out of that. I may... Yeah, that's just not worth it. It'd be better if I had more than 20 cargo space. It's not worth my risk, I don't think, for 4,000 bucks. That guy's gonna shoot me. Thank you, asteroid. Oh, he got me! No! No! Stop it! Only now everyone shows up. Man, I keep dying. Okay. Let's try something different. I got my medical. It just, ain't, it just ain't getting me any money. I gotta find a way to get better money. And I think I was getting good stuff when I was finding those, like... Those, like, uh... <clears throat> questionable people. That was good stuff. Three passengers for 27,000. Two passengers for 24. I don't have space for either of those. I do if I sell both my, my people off. And that would be 50,000 bucks. Um, what was the safe mission? Just two passengers for 10,000? Not worth it. Yeah. I feel like I'm playing EVE Online. I pop in and, and someone just walks in and just like destroys me. <laughs> I was like, what just happened? <laughs> yeah, if I buy one of the double cargo please I'm going to get a lot more money. But it's... Oh boy, here we go. It's still only... What? 8,000 for this trip. If I can get a, a sketchy spaceport person, then that's that's good stuff. Do I have this one already? Where's that mission? No. 5,700 bucks. I'll do it. <laughs> That's how I played Eve, yeah. <laughs> no. I'll take my one piece of food and go over there. Eighty-eight bucks. 
Okay, so then we, we can go back and do that. Or, you know what we can do? We could go do this mission. We got this exciting mission down here, the pirate reconnaissance. That's exciting. It's gonna take a while to get there. We can run down here. Is that where we start? Fly through Han, Lysath, Aniet, and Etria. These four here. Do some recon. That sounds exciting. That's real exciting. Yeah. 18 jumps. It's gonna take a little bit to get there. Good rush delivery to, to far far point. That's good. Where is Kelda? Oh, it's right there. Okay. We'll stop off. We'll drop off these helmets for some money. I'll do that one. I'm gonna go through Beetlejuice. I'll take a passenger to Beetlejuice. Okay. So, Alan Alan attack is first, and we'll take some. Medical there. All right, let's land. Anybody have a job? I'm already going to Beetlejuice, so we can take a delivery of varnish. There. Um, yeah, I'm sell those things anyways. I'll take that one also. Let's just, like, load up on stuff. What's corporate espionage? Intercept it and make detailed scans of its cargo for syndicate researchers. Now that's exciting. That's the kind of jobs I need to be doing. I think I want to go there, and I'm going to be going that way anyway, I think. We're just going to mark, we'll make up Beetlejuice first, and then we'll work our way down wherever else. Uh, that's the one I got to sell, right? Yeah. Same around here. Not for me, though. I'm a scared little shuttle. <clears throat> Land? We're gonna make our way down here. So there's some tactile switches. Tourist by the 25th of April. Sure. We're going to where? We're going to Shroud. Where's that one at? Oh, okay, so we'll go there, drop that one off, and then head down here. We'll take the wealthy people. For 40,000. I can do that one too for uh, for fifteen thousand. Okay, we're gonna go by Alhika first. There's a little bit of cash, and then Alhika doesn't have really anything. We'll drop off some luxury goods on the way there. Okay, done. Uh, there's more going to the same system. Three passengers. That's the one I'm doing right now, right? No, it's a different one. So three for 1,800. I'll do the three. Oh. Oh, I have to fire my two crewmen. Uh, okay. Then, uh, if there's anything we can sell there, we'll do it. Industrial. Okay. Maybe I'm getting somewhere. We're got. I'm up to four hundred thousand. I'm 
Look at that guy. I thought he was a planet. Which one do I go to? I went on Calda. This one. Okay, lots of money. And didn't have, didn't, oh, the other system has one also. Okay. Um, I guess they have the same prices no matter where they go. Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, well, we'll drop them off. And then we need to go way down here. Good money for medical down there. Um, I must want to look at jobs, though. Take a family down there. So let's go across the way. To the other system, the other station. Over here, Veil. Let me guess, mountains. Make money. And then we can... Is there a mission here? Pick up 14 tons of it in on Asgard in the Neo system. Right here? Return it to Vale for 77,000. Where do I need to go for it? Oh, up there. A lot of money, but... 18 tons of humidifiers. Dehumidifiers for eighteen thousand. We're gonna go that way. I do it. Okay. That guy broke busted? What's wrong with that guy? No, no. Okay. I can't really carry anything else. There's a rush delivery down there for thirty two thousand and one way up that way. I could go that way. Two, three, four. We can go to Sirius. So I'll take this mission. We'll go. We'll go to Sirius. Drop off some metal in Sirius. Oh, uh, oh! You have the scout, do you? I think I can buy the scout now. I should buy the scout. Is that what I want? I think I do, because the scout has 120 office space versus, like, I think I have 80. Uh, well, he's only got one. No, that's not what I want. What's the one I had before that I wanted? He's only got one. No, it's me. Ha, ha. I'm 120. He's 220. Two gun ports. I'm buying this guy. 1.27 million. We're going to go to the bank. We're going to take on a... Uh, is that enough? I've gotten it real close. 1.2... Four, I think is what I have. I think. I'm real close. <clears throat> so if I take a loan out for that much. I'm 1.249. Um, I can't quite buy that ship. <laughs> I really want it. Oh, it doesn't count mine yet. Okay, so I want to buy. I want to buy this. So, but wait, I have one point two four nine. I can sell my ship. Yep, I'm going to buy the scout. I have one point five million. Does that give me anything else? Anything cooler? Now these are all many, many millions. <clears throat> I will take. I'll take a scout. Name my sh my my scout. Um, oh, this is the uh, the good ship. Um, 
<laughs> Bob Ross Jr. Okay, so Bob has lots of cargo space, and he's got gun ports. So I'll buy more medical. Fill to the cargo hold. Look at that cargo hold. And then we can go to the uh, outfitter. How much money do I have? 200,000. I could buy some guns. I have two energy blasters on the ship already. Oh, oh, they're already on there. The mounts are already on there. That's even better. Uh, can I get a better shield generator? What do I have? I got this baby guy. Office oh, space is 22 needed. This is 15. So I could have, I could do this one for better shields. That's an eight jump take. Wow. There's a ram scoop. For refueling. Is there a... It must be like a tractor beam or something. Yeah, I got a lot of bunks. And I can turn one of those bunks into an expansion, right? This one. Adds 15. I guess it just adds on the mass. It doesn't actually do anything like that. This one takes away from cargo space, I think, right? Um, okay. I'll buy one of these guns again. <laughs> yeah, more, more. There's a cargo scanner. It allows you to scan cargo holds every ship as you're targeting. Yeah, let me slap one of those on here. I buy one of those. We can cargo, we can asteroid scan if we want to go do some of that. There's a hyperdrive. Mm -hmm. Radar jammer, that sounds exciting too. Okay, let's try that. Let's try that. Ooh, a heavy laser, huh? Okay, so I've got... Um, let me hire a couple crew. Also. Okay, and we're going to Sirius, right? We gotta get our, our solar panels in that. So we're gonna go to Sirius first. And do I, you see I have eight jumps on this thing? One, two, three, look at that. That's exciting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I can go there all the way there. Oh man, I just bought a Prius. I can go there. I don't have to. I don't have to like. And now I, my medical isn't much of a deal. I should go and buy. I should buy my, my medical. I should buy some medical. But I should buy metal, not medical. Whatever. Um. Yeah, I want metal. Metals what I want. Or actually. Okay. All right. Eight jumps. Now I'm moving. Hey, T Kitty, how's it going? I wonder what it, uh, like what, um, what I need to do for those systems. Can I just like? jump through there? Do I need to like, stop and do some scans or something? Hey, look, there's Earth. Well, there's Mars anyway. Okay, we're landing on this Tundra system. If I see some pirates... I can shoot him. Okay. Any jobs here? We're trying to go down this direction. Do I have a mission to go to Gemstone? Whoops. I forgot about, <laughs> I forgot about these people over in my cargo hold. 44 tons of reactor grade uranium for 69,000. Now that's more like it. I'm gonna say, sorry people, you live in you live on Tundra World now. I'm a, I apologize for 
for that. You, <laughs> I hope you like the snow. <laughs> okay, let's go there. Um, yeah, let's. I gotta drop off my stuff first. That's some money. Now we're um, we're gonna go there. Anybody spaceport? No. What do you want to buy? Down here. You want to buy a lot of heavy metals for a lot of money. <clears throat> That's the risk of being on the being a passenger on the Bob Ross Jr. That's right. Sometimes you get the devil beat out of you. Am I here? Oh no. They should be happy they didn't find their, their way out of an airlock. Pirates, huh? Pirates, huh? Let me at him. Whoa, devil. Oh. I hit him a couple times. Does that count? If we want to go to deep. There's the money. So I gotta go into... Fly through those systems and then report to Glaze in there. So we wanna go, I guess we'll go around this. Well, does that connect? Where am I at? I'm right here. Let's go here. There's a mission going to Atria. What is that one? Three passengers? Sure. Hop on board. So yeah, let's go to Lasath. I'm assuming there's gonna be some pirates around there. Pirates are exciting. Yeah, make us some money. I think I've only explored this. The I've only explored the core worlds. I think it grows as we go further out. Am I right about this? We'll see if some more pop up here when we get this way. Is there anywhere to stop here? No. Okay, so we're in the system. We just gotta keep on keep on moving. We gotta go to Atria, so let's go there. I think this is kind of like a, just like a dangerous system to fly through. This ship's a lot more a lot more maneuverable too. Yeah, so new things pop up as we fly through. <clears throat> okay, um, you got a map? Nice. Gotta answer that question. No, maybe not. I think these are new. Okay, so there's a there's a we gotta go through Han anyway, so we might as well take those passengers there. It's not very much money. We'll just, we'll just fly to Han. Um, I'll drop some passengers off over there. Why is that one orange? Are they not very friendly with me? Why is that one orange? That's the one where the scary folks were. We'll go to we'll go to Han and we'll drop off these folks at wherever they want to go. And I don't know what's in Han. I could sell these luxury goods for a little bit of money, but this isn't really that be, that good of a price. I can get better. I suppose I might as well buy, sell them and then yeah, I'll sell them. Never mind. Never mind. Buy some plastic. Ooh, that hurts. Ah, hold together, shields. Oh, you're a bad guy, too? Where's the good guys? My shields are about down. Land already, land, land. 
Uf. Aquí. Mm. Those are both garbage missions. But I'll do them. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's not very good. Okay, all's good. So that cargo for a weapon, weapon, three thousand. Pirates warping in. Oh, there's a bunch of pirates. Am I in the? I'm in like the this system. I need to go to. Where's the mission telling me to go? Dock where? Just go anywhere and, and drop them off. Okay. Well, tell the people stop shooting me, and I will. Yeah, I got friends now, so I'm now I'm more brave. Okay, I'm not brave anymore. Whoa, whoa, where's it going? Why is it landing me over? Why is it landing me over here? Ow! If I was in a shuttle, I'd have gotten blown up a long time ago. Twenty-five thousand? Come on now. See a message from Freya. Um, hello, Captain Starpath. I pray you're still interested in being part of the Thousand Eyes program. We need more intel on enemy systems in the middle of the dirt belt. Maybe it would be a bit better than last time since they, these systems are a bit more out of the way. Okay. I'm a little disappointed, though. Where do you want me to go? I've been through this. Those aren't out of the way. I've been there before. I'm going to Shula because I want to see what's going on down there. Let's go to Shula. I want to see what's there. And Shula, I feel like, is going to need some industrial. I suppose money will start to increase pretty quickly. We can go back to the bank and drop some things off. Um, I'll pay them, like, 150000 Which actually isn't that bad, because I took a... How much did I take out? I took 700 and something, so yeah, maybe we'll, we'll get it there. <clears throat> okay. Okay, let's get out of here. It's red, and I'm, I, I know I saw somewhere it said something along the lines of what that meant, but I don't know what it was. Oh, because Green Rock is hostile. I bet they're hostile because I didn't do that mission. Oh, I'm going to die. I'm going to die, but I'm going to go out. I'm going to go out shooting with my new ship. Oh, yeah. Look at them all. Can I talk to him? Uh, I'm going to offer you a bribe. Okay. Is it all of them? They all leave me alone? Well, nice. I refuse to let me land here. Can I talk? Um, I can demand tribute. It'll cost you... I demand... <laughs> okay, I'll do it. What do I get for being here? What do I, can I get anything new? Ooh, you have a cool ship. A wasp. Ooh, look at that guy. Fancy. Wow. 15 million. Do you have a cool job? Are these all boring? Smuggling. Ah, smuggling. That's more like it. I want an individual, a new, new Sagittarius. He wants to get there without getting caught. We got drug runs over here to Dune. 106. Wow. 204,000 to go over there. How many jumps is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So I can't make it. I'd have to drop in Vega. 
Without being scanned or caught by the planetary law enforcement. I think I can stay in Vega. Maybe Minket is the less... Well, Vega seems okay. It's pretty close to Seoul. I'm a... Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm Seoul. Let's do it. Make some money. Make some real money. Uh, where is... Do you have a map? Nerve gas? Grenades? I'll buy some of those. These guys have the real good stuff. I have space for... No, I don't. I, never mind. <clears throat> I, um... I wasn't showing it. I can shoot. I forgot W shoots and my other guns as well. Buy all that. So, yeah. So, let's go to... We're going to Vega. Bootleg alcohol. Oh, I shouldn't have bought that stuff. Okay. Some stolen antique swords. <laughs> Some knockoff pocket watches when I go to Earth. Okay, so let's go to Anka. Yeah, we're adding new systems in here. Okay. paid a lot of a lot of money to bribe my way through that system so if i had done that one i bet i would have been buddies with them and i could have been doing like pirate missions back then oh man that's what i get for being the nice guy <sighs> i could have had some exciting jobs is there a mission here oh okay i see yeah it's that one the pirate scanning one Also, auto rotate your ship to track the target without very without in other input. Hmm. No scanning, sir. Trying to scan me? Don't do it. Okay, I'm just here for, for fueling up. Because then we're going over here. Do I have anything I can sell here? Yeah, I'll sell a little bit of that. If anything, I don't know what's what's in Anka. So I'll just buy stuff that's cheap, medical. Uh, I see a sizable group of people waiting on a lottery draw. You hear a whoop of success. Your attention is drawn. One of the them wins the moderate sum of a, in a 12th division win. Um, they buy more tickets. Oh, all right, that's exciting. Get out of here quick. I'm almost broke. If they're gonna make me pay a bribe, I'm gonna be in real trouble. Which I have a feeling they're gonna. Maybe not. Ah, yeah, syndicate space. 204,000 credits. What kind of jobs do you have for me? Oh, these are just normal jobs. Um, the new green initiative of the, of the syndicate. No, that's a lovely tip. Thanks. Um, let's see. We'll sell those things off. And we'll buy some heavy metals. Anything spaceport? Oh, there we go. Looking at jobless things when a man with a harried face approaches carrying a package. I need this package delivered to the next four days. 17,000 credits once it's done. Without 
waiting for a response. He shoves the package into your hands and runs off. 17,000. We're supposed to get to silver, which is not within three jumps. Back to Vega. I was just in Vega. Let's just, um, I'm going to dump it in. I'm going to give it to someone else. Okay. I'm just going to leave, and I'm going to go fly down here and see what we see. It is all syndicate. Look at those ships. Ah, oh, there's the container transport. What's it have cargo room? 550 tons. 640. Man, that's the money. Everything's cheap here. Uh, there's somebody who looking to go looking to get away for for fifty thousand. Okay. Lots of missions going there. Where's this guy want to go? Down there. Okay, I want to go that way anyway. Let's go this way. Let's see how to get there. How do we get there? Okay. So yeah, we'll go there. What's the mission over here? Nah, I'm not doing that one. We'll go there. 50,000 credits. Sure. And I'm going to try to see if I'm going to fight. When we get there. Weird town of weapons near. Okay, here he comes. Here he comes. This is my, my victim. I'm winning this fight. Look at his shields. I think he came in damaged, though. Well, there's two of them now. His shields are almost down. Sounds nasty. I want... I don't want to offer a bribe. I want to shoot the guy. <laughs> oh, he got away. I'm calling that a win. That seems good. I'm kind of at the. Oh, we got. We can go over this way now. Twelve thousand over that way. We can go up that way. You know what? Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. End of stream time. Let's go out in style. Um, I'm gonna hire some crew. Hire five crew. And. I want to see if I can figure out how to attack folks. Um, hostage, but we got R for that one. Talk is T. Board is B. It doesn't seem to be working, though. We can scan. I'll try scanning ships, the next ship that comes in. Scan that guy. Here we go. We got one coming in. He looks big, though. Ooh, he's real big. <laughs> oh, look how big he is. He's just tearing me up. Oh, there we go. The good guys have arrived. Oh, 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 oh. There I go. There I go. Oh, 
man. I'm pretty sure you can you can board other ships and you can like take them, but I just don't know how to I just don't know how to do it. Maybe I need a ship. Maybe I need some sort of like a airlock system or something to get me out there. Anyway, that's uh that's going out with a bang. Let's call it a day. There's endless sky. It's free. Uh, in this in the Stellaris soundtrack, that's not free, but endless sky is free. I had the crew, I had guns, I had grenades, I had all the stuff. I couldn't figure out how to get them to... I, 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 if, as soon as they were disabled, they blew up. So I'm, not, I'm not sure. <clears throat> so, earlier today, someone called up, and they, um, they, they just... As soon as I picked up the phone, they just sneezed, and then they hung up. I'll tell you what. I'm getting sick and tired of these cold calls. There you go. Look how big space is. I was in Shula. Yeah. Lot, lots more space. Lots more bad dad jokes as well. See, look at this. There we go. <clears throat> I never forgot how to, get, how to get there. Cool. Oh yeah, I never hit I to show me that my, my ship. Anyway, there's Endless Sky. Thanks for hanging out tonight. Lots of stuff outside the rim, but you need jump tech. Oh yeah, that's all. I saw the hyperdrive. That's that's what we do with that. Completely free. What a game. And it's like um, lots of new stuff is coming in. There was an update just recently, and I guess they're they're trying to redo the uh, a lot of the artwork and stuff for the Steam page. All right, I'm going to bed. Thanks for hanging out. I will see you all next time. I'll see you tomorrow. And um, let's go do a little raid and... <clears throat>